Hello, for this video I will introduce how to start using tokenizer and also demonstrate path sequences tool in NLP with TensorFlow and Keras. The idea behind the path sequences tool is that it allows you to use sentences of different lengths and use padding or truncation to make all of these sentences to the same length. In this case, I have the sentences. I love my dog. I love my cat. You love my dog. And the last one, do you think my dog is amazing? Which is a different land from these other sentences. This all had four words. This one has more. I'm going to use tokenizer with parameters called an OOV token that is dedicated for out of vocabulary words. The idea here is that I'm going to create a new token, a special token that I'm going to use for words that aren't recognized, that aren't in the word index itself. I'm going to create something unique here that I wouldn't expect to see in the corpus. I'm going to specify my OOE token is over these sentences. I'm going to call tokenizer fit and text sentences and I'm going to take a look at the word index for that. We'll see now. That is my word index. OOV is now value equal to 1. My is value 2. Love is value 3. And so on. We have a total of 11 words. 11 unique words in the corpus. It is actually 10 words plus 1 OOV token. So, on the tokenizer, I can convert words in, in those sentences to sequences of tokens by calling the text to sequences method. That's going to produce sequences. That's what I'm printing out here. So my sequences are 5, 3, 2, 4. For the first sentence, which is I love my dog and 5, 3, 2, 7 and so on. So these are the sequences. 5, 3, 2, 4, 5, 3, 2, 7, 6, 3, 2, 4, H, 6, 9, 2, and 4, 1, 0, 1, 1. Now we can see these are all different lengths, but we want to make them the same length. So that's where the path sequences come into it. I'm going to say here my path is set is path sequences with the sequences. Let's make it a maximum length of, of 5 words. This is maximum length of 5 words means that these 4 letters or these 4 words sentences end up being prepared with a 0. This 6 word sentence ends up having the first word cut off because we had set a maximum length equal to 5. We can see now that they are prepared with zeros including this long sentence. It's being prepared with a single zero. Let's have another example of this case. My test data is I really love my dog and my dog loves my manatee. If I now tokenize them and create sequences out that we'll see 5, 1, 3, 2, 4 for the first sentences. 5 is I, 1 is out of vocabulary because really wasn't actually there and our ones 3 to 4. So this is how the outer vocabulary token comes into it. When it sees a word that wasn't in the word index, it will replace it just use the out of vocabulary token with value of 1 for that. Similarly, for my dogs love my manatee, I get 2, 4, 1, 2, 1. The word love is not in the even if the word love is and of course manatee isn't it. So I end up with just 2, 4, 2. And here you can see how they're padding them. So my 5, 1, 3, 2, 4 gets padded and my 
24121 also gets padded because I would say a max length of 10. If I apply that, we will see end up getting truncated. I'm getting the last two words here. I'm getting the last two words here so that a, a basic introduction to how to connect the words and how padding actually works to give you a padding to be able to get your sentences at, at the same length. I think this is all what I wanted to say in this video and see you.